Uh, this is the scene in Philadelphia. Again, they supported this. Look how many people are here. Thousands and thousands. I, I was actually a little bit impressed on how many people they got out to support these Black Lives Matter protests. But then again, I'm not surprised with 40 million people out of a job and who have been cooked up at home for so many months that, yeah, they're probably going to go out for the new PSYOP of the month. So look how crowded these, this looks like a 4th of July cele celebration. So you have a lot of people just crowding the streets and no one is saying anything. The media is not saying they have to social distance. I mean, they were getting on us. They were arresting people on beaches saying you couldn't go on a beach. They had helicopters going after people. Surfers were arrested. Yes, surfers. A surfer alone on the beach, he was arrested. And they allow this? I mean, I want to get angry, but I'm not. But it's just, if you want to talk about in, injustice, this is it. This is injustice to all the people you force to follow your phony rules about your fake plague. But one thing that caught my eye, you see this? You see this wide gate that people are flowing through, this, this kind of horde of people? I couldn't help but remember a Bible quote. And that quote is, Enter by the narrow gate, for wide is the gate, and broad is the way that leads to destruction, and there are many who go in by it. Because narrow is the gate, and difficult is the way which leads to life, and there are few who find it. Yep, that is a wide gate indeed. I would estimate that, uh, at least in the cities, most people support this totally. Just flowing through that wide gate. Well, I'm going to say no to that. I'm not going to go through that gate. I am on the narrow path. And uh, I pray that God will keep me here because it's going to get easier and easier as they push their evil onto us to get off the narrow path and want the approval and comfort of what the wide path can give. Of Just like the, um, that Swedish police officer, how the crowd was cheering her and she put her fist up and she held that sign. That's the wide path. That's a woman taking the wide path, the broad path of doing what the world wants her to do, what the mob wants her to do, because it, it feels good. It feels good to be cheered on by dozens and dozens of people. It just, your dopamine, I mean, just, it feels great. It feels good to sleep around. It feel good, feels good to live in the city and gorge yourself on alcohol and food and so on. But that's the wide gate, and that leads to nowhere.